Today's story is The Red Rose. Once upon a time, a red rose bloomed in a garden. Look at that red rose, it is so beautiful. It is just perfect. I wish even I had a beautiful flower. How do you say that? Everyone has their own good quality. It is true I am the most beautiful. There is nothing as beautiful as me. I don't know what I am doing in this garden. Why do you say that? Because it is the truth. Look around. Look at the cactus there, so hard and thorny. In fact, I am going to try and move away from it right now. The rose tried a lot, but could not move away from the cactus. You are so proud of yourself, but you forget that you have thorns too. One day you will learn to appreciate others for what they are. It is okay, sunflower. There is no need to get angry about what the rose says. The days went by and summer came. It was dry and hot with no sign of rain. The rose was the most affected by the lack of water. But it often saw birds go to the cactus and dig into it with their beaks. What are they doing to the cactus? The cactus has water stored in its leaves. The birds are drinking the water from it. Doesn't it hurt? It does, but cactus doesn't mind. I know you are very thirsty. Maybe you can ask him, too. Humbled by what it had just learned, the rose asked the cactus if it could have some water, too. I am very thirsty. May I please have some water? Of course. Why didn't you ask me earlier? You can drink as much as you want. The birds will bring it to you in their beaks. Thank you so much. The rose's pride was now broken. It accepted the water from the cactus and changed the way he behaved with the other plants.